Good morning, 47. Our Providence contact has shared the identity of the Shadow Client, a former mercenary and bodyguard by the name of Lucas Gray. His past is a black void, but our analysts are digging deep. Meanwhile, we've had a breakthrough of our own. Comparing the malicious attack patterns with global shipping and transportation routes, we've figured out how Mr. Gray and his paramilitaries move around the world undetected. They're using the distribution network of the Delgado Cartel, Colombia's biggest drug manufacturer. Clearly, Gray must have struck a deal with the Delgados. Consequently, if we can cripple the cartel, we can severely limit the malicious strike range. But to do so, we need to slay a three-headed serpent. Sociopathic cartel head Rico Delgado and his two closest lieutenants, PR guru Andrea Martinez and savant chemist Jorge Franco. With equal parts guts and guile, Rico Delgado runs a thriving billion-dollar criminal empire. The word is, the brutal and volatile cartel head is hell-bent on becoming the number one drug lord in the world. To achieve this, Martinez, a childhood friend of Delgado's, has been buttering up state leaders and decision makers, paving the way for an expansion of the Delgado logistics network, while the brilliant but aloof and antisocial Franco has been hard at work developing a new type of super cocaine. So, three of Colombia's most infamous crime lords inhabiting a decidedly hostile environment. I will leave you to prepare. Welcome to Colombia, 47. The remote village of Santa Fortuna awaits you deep inside the Colombian rainforest. An iron-fisted Delgado cartel rules over the village and its surroundings. Security around Santa Fortuna and the closed-off cartel compound is extremely tight. Armed sicarios patrol the streets of the village, ready to enforce harsh punishments to those who do not comply. Rumors persist of hidden transportation cave systems connecting the village, the cartel compound, and the hidden coca fields beyond. It is a rare occurrence to have all three cartel leaders present in the village at the same time. Expect that all targets are protected by scrupulous killers armed with automatic weapons. Rico Delgado inhabits his fortified mansion on the outskirts of the village, while Andrea Martinez can be found in her village office or around Santa Fortuna itself. And Jorge Franco is engaged in development of a new drug in his field laboratory. Happy hunting, 47. Imagínate una barrera en tu mente, y yo que se extiende de tus manos, de tus brazos en mí. Hacemos eso, estemos fuera de esa zona, en mi espacio personal. ¿Entiendes? I mean, 
the biggest celebrity tattoo artist in the world. Maybe he's here to see that Delgado guy we've been hearing about. Sounds like he's got money to spare. Could be. <gasps> so, pea power celebrity tattooist of Tattoo Torment fame, has come to Santa Fortuna, presumably to work his magic on Rico Delgado, a known ink enthusiast. Sounds like an invitation to the mansion, 47. Are you feeling expressive? Guy, I wish I could afford one of this. Do you mind giving me some privacy here? Someone who knows how to actually fix this damn thing.
Why the party last night? Sí, lo pregunto porque joder, a mí no tengo que decir. Pero perdón, no tengo nada. That is P-Power, real name Paul Powers, celebrity tattoo artist and reality TV star. Hey, I'm telling you, I've been in some crazy shit before, and this takes the cake. Uh -huh. I don't know where I'm supposed to be, man. Delgado Convention. Just knock on the front gate. And then what? Walk in oh, and God, text in the loudest, most notorious I am being psychic. I can see. I asked for something. I'm, I'm sorry. sorry. Just for the fun. Imagine what you do to me if I messed up. Sure, he's dangerous. This is why if you need to look out for Caballero, I'm a dead man. So sorry, so I really need to use the toilet. Oh my god. I feel so sick! Nothing in my position. Just standing here scratching my bones. Yeah, but it's a pretty Show yourself! Keep it in. You can make it.
power guy. Hang on, man. I hope you don't mind, but we need to freeze. Many viewers pass I need to look through your pockets there's no two ways about it you're entering the lion's den 47 tread carefully ah, senor, practically everyone here is dangerous bad, not least not Rico Delgado himself all right you're Mr. good Bauer. to go Pongale, follow Pongale. me to the house Mrs. Delgado wanted to meet you she's a big fan she take it to Rico my sister got at her two ones it was supposed to be a tribute to her son, but the guy fucked it up. The big Gustavo ended up looking like a dead chupacabra. When my brother-in-law saw the tattoo, he went down to the guy's house. He shot him dead. Which was kind of dumb, because he was the only tattoo artist around for a hundred miles. That's quite a story. You bet. That is Catalina Delgado, wife to Rico Delgado for the past 11 years. Power. It's such an honor to meet you. I just love your show. That episode where you tattoo the heart on the heart of the dead dying policeman while they're administrating CPR. <laughs> it's the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. A great moment. I cherish the memory to this day. Oh, see. So, Rico has this tattoo on his neck and he insists it's supposed to be based on a photo of me. I'm not a fool, Mr. Powers. My nose never looked like that, not even before the operation. And sure, I've had a few ticks done here and there, but nothing as drastic as that. I want you to make it look like me, not some young skank. I'll do my very best, Mrs. Delgado. Ah, oh, Chico, let me just grab a quick selfie with you, all right? Sure, why not? Yay! Just look this way. Oh, can see. Wow, we look so good together. This is great. Hey. So far, so good, 47. Now to leave your mark on Mr. Delgado. So, this is the famous Pete Bauer, tattoo artist to the stars. Yeah. You don't exactly look like you do on TV, do you? Something different about you. Carino, don't insult our guest. He's obviously not been sitting in a stylist chair for days, but this is Pete Bauer. Who else would it be? Well, what about those cheekbones? The guy on TV didn't have cheekbones like that. Hey, Rico, enough. You know they fix all that in post-production. Just let the man work. Okay, fine. Whatever you say. Okay, I'm ready. Let's get this thing fixed. Are you doing this just to annoy me, Cat? Oh, stop being so grumpy, Rico. You can't focus here, all right? What's the problem? You don't even have to do anything. Whoa, hey, Rico, don't worry. I've got this under control. Hey, hey, two guy. I'm watching. One wrong move, you know, I start peeing. You hear me? Hey, relax, Jose. We're fine. Better safe than sorry, boss. You're making me nervous, Jose. Put that thing away. No way, I'm letting my guard down around this stranger, Rico. You need to keep still, Mr. Delgado. I wouldn't want to stab you by accident. You heard the man, Catalina. Leave us now. Fine. I did your way. But that tattoo better look exactly like me when you're done with your new BFF, Rico. Calm down, all right? Everything's okay here. Just doing what's necessary, Rico. Hey, I need you to stand down. Stop waving that thing around. I'm sorry, but I'm just doing my job, Patron. So what are we waiting for, huh? I'm here, I'm ready. Get on with it. Hey, Jose, I need you to leave us alone now. You're too wound up right now. You understand? All right, boss, all right. But I'll be back in a little while if I don't hear from you way one. Oh, finally. So peace and quiet. Can I finish my work now? <laughs> do what you do best, man. 
You got it. Rico Delgado has been eliminated. Nicely done. Time flies when you're having fun. Exotic and sumptuous heated mud baths for a full body hyper detox. Wow, I've never done a hyper detox before. That's my personal favorite, but it might be under maintenance right now. You know, it's part of the risk of COVID at this time of the year. But La Jungla is gorgeous all year round, so don't worry about that. Like a Hi. Mother. Uh, whatever. Oh, oh, oh that. Did you 
see the poster? Rico Delgado coming down to us dirty villages. Ridiculous statue. Sure, I was at the bar last night and the band were really good. Both. But my husband told me nobody can see them. So that's why Martinez and Delgado carry some running around like idiots. Martinez will find out. She always gets in her way. Oh my god. This is Hong Kong. Oh my Could I ask god. you to leave and close You're the door behind? You're killing me, right? Gracias. been like smuggling this cocaine souvenir around the world, right? I need to get it to this dude, uh, Franco. Man, it, it broke. It's supposed to be in one piece when I delivered over by some cave entrance behind the pharmacy, but it broke. Bummer, man. Maybe just glue it together? I don't know. I think it's gonna ruin the taste test. This Franco guy is like a blood... So, a drug dealer from Sapienza has been testing a new method for smuggling Delgado brand cocaine into Europe, baking the substance into souvenirs, coated in a special anti-drug detection paint solution. The dealer has been traveling the globe, testing the method. However, he accidentally broke the souvenir on arrival and needs to mend it before going to see Franco.
Estamos re bien. Huh? Oh my god. Help! Help! I know my last idea didn't pan out, but this beauty will. It's slower than a taxi, much more uncomfortable, not as safe. Yet, it is cheaper than a taxi, and tourists would pay a lot more to buy one. It's incredible!
almost gone now. That was some good pie, man. I don't think I've seen colors like that ever. Hey, 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 Mister. Let it fall. What are you doing? What are you doing? Not the asshole. Thank you, Scott. Ah, so, despite an annoying delay, it's finally here. Let's have a look. It got through customs without a problem, we hope? I had no issues. Excellent. We're not sure whether this will pass the taste test, but that remains to be seen. Follow us, please. Nice 147. And now for Franco to sample his handiwork. Oh man, we feel sick. Sorry, let us through. No, no, no. Franco confirmed down. Nice work, 47.
Stacy. That foundation look entirely stable to you? Well, I'm not based on that. Something strange is happening. I'll check it out. John. You, can go. Deal with Gotcha. Uh-huh. Have you noticed how Andre has started working out and his deodorant and hair products? She, yeah. At ease, soldier. He's definitely having an affair. Oh, 
targets neutralized. This should paralyze the cartel. Excellent work, 47. Now head for an exit. Looking good, man. Looking good. 